What in the world is this? It's a toilet mask. What the heck? Look, your face goes in the toilet. <laughs> I told you to stay away. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy crap, guys, today we are in South Burlington, Vermont, and I just went into this party city right here to see if they had Halloween stuff. At first, it didn't look too promising, but then I kept turning aisle after aisle after aisle, and there was tons of awesome stuff. Come in here with me, and I'm gonna show you. Oh, heck yeah, right in the door. Look at this, guys. We have the Michael Myers life-size cardboard stand-up. He is 74 inches tall. Look at that, how cool is that? from Halloween 2. I would love to see that thing set up. They might even have one set up in here, but I don't see anything yet. Okay, here is also the Pennywise, and he's got a balloon. That looks pretty cool. Obviously, he has a balloon. <laughs> oh, sweet, we have Chucky. A Chucky stand-up. How tall is he? He's 40 inches tall. Look at that. How awesome is that? That is so cool. Oh look, you can just put it right together like that. Hi Chucky. All right, let's see. Anything else over? Oh, nothing else over here. Hold on. I didn't look up when I was over here. Okay, just Michael Myers. Kind of surprises me they don't have Jason. But okay, let's go on over here. It looks like they are just preparing to put stuff out. So they don't have a whole lot yet, but let's go look at what they do have. Oh, look, they have some things set up back here. Not a whole lot set up yet in the costume department over here. They do always have this huge wall. Instead of actually having like a billion costumes for people to try on and stuff, um, they do always have this huge wall here that you can actually just come up and look at the costumes. And then they have numbers on them. So like if you wanted to be the hospital honey, <laughs> 538. That is hilarious. The hospital, honey. What the heck? Okay, look at this. I kind of like this one. The Sugar Skull Beauty. I like all those colors. They've got a lot of different costumes here to choose from. Oh, look, it's the Banana Man. It's, he's called Going Bananas. Riding Hood. Queen Bee. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I love these. The Flappers. That's cool. Then we have the spooky stuff over here. The Phantom of Darkness, Glaring Reaper, Dark King, Demonic Beast, Plague Doctor, and so on. Look at the uh, the skeleton suits here. Reminds me of the Karate Kid, the Cobra Kai. Look at this giant inflatable South Park Cartman. That's pretty cool. All right, let's go ahead and yeah, just move over here and look. I see some more stuff, even though most of this is pretty empty. And look, they do have the cardboard uh, standees standing up here. Here's Chucky. And then we got Michael Myers. Ooh, somebody bent his head. Michael's coming after that person. And Pennywise here. Pretty cool, okay. Different props sitting around waiting to be set up. There's Halloween decor waiting. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. We got the mega zombie. <laughs> What the heck? Look at this thing. Look at this guy's face. His skull is protruding from his face. That is disgusting. All right, let's move on down here. There's another one laying right there. Appar apparently somebody slayed him. And then we have Invasion of the Skeletons. Tons of life-size skeletons. These are all, what, five feet tall? Let's look. Yeah, five-foot posable skeleton. How much are these? Hmm, I don't even see a price on them, but they're cool. Five-feet skeleton. People buy these big skeletons here, and I've even seen people buy the, uh, the big 12-foot skeleton from, what was it, Lowe's or Home Depot? I can't remember. Home Depot, I think. And uh, they, like, mummify them, and they, they, they call it corpsing. They make it look like it's an actual dead person. Look at this. What the heck? <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't get this. I'm Yorick, the skeleton with a real funny bone. What in the world? It looks like they literally come with the black bow tie. Like what the heck does a black bow tie have to do 
with anything. Look, I love the little ads they have on the end here of what you can do with your uh, skeletons. Look, these two are having a picnic. Oh my gosh, it's in a cemetery too. They're having a picnic in a cemetery and they have a blade in the basket. <laughs> and this one is dressed up like Freddy. Only they should have had the uh, the slice and dice glove on him. And look at this, holy crap. He's taking, taking my eight-legged friends for a walk. He's got two giant spiders on a leash. They just got a few things over here, like a Tom Sawyer hat. Look at this, Tom Sawyer and Huck Finn. I should be Huck Finn for, for, for Halloween. <laughs> oh my gosh, a giant sombrero. Have any of you ever gone to like a Mexican restaurant and it's your birthday and they come over and put the sombrero on you before they start singing happy birthday? They used to do that at Chi Chi's all the time. Okay, look at this. We got a cheeseburger hat. Ooh, it puffs up to actually look like a burger on your head. And then we've got the Mad Hatter top hat here. Look, it's got the bunny ears and a clock on the front. That is pretty cool actually. I love that. Many a sequin hat. What the heck would you even wear this for? It's very sparkly like a disco ball. Worker hats. Is this a football hat? Oh my gosh, it is. Who's gonna wear a football on their head? Man, this is a huge area that they're getting ready to prepare. And even this gets me excited for Halloween. Just seeing like the black paper go up on the background and the little bits and pieces of Halloween merchandise sitting around. It looks like there's a little bit more over here. Let's take a look, just some costumes. Oh yeah, okay, they got a whole bunch of things over here. Let's take a look at these real quick. We got a couple of Wonder Woman outfits here. Uh, let's see, here's the golden lasso of truth. <laughs> Birds of prey, oh my gosh, I cannot stand Harley Quinn. Holy crap, oh look at this, this is cool. It's a reversible cape, you can be Batman or Superman, or you can be both. And there's always gotta be the Harry Potter costumes. Ooh, Gryffindor socks, these are cool. Hufflepuff tie. Oh, look at this, we got Hedwig. <laughs> what in the world? This is a shiny black sequin like skull mask. That looks kinda cool. I would totally wear that to a Halloween party. I like this to the skeleton jaw mask. Whenever I have to wear a mask in a store, I should wear this. We've got some Day of the Dead masks here. These actually look really cool. I like the hat and I love the colors in there. A couple of top hats. Oh my gosh, I see this guy every year, the I Love Bingo Man. <laughs> so hilarious. I love this one. They should make a costume with my face and my hat. Uncle Bobby, okay. Snot your problem. Okay, that's disgusting. What is the dead on arrival? That looks like a uh, a bad Freddy Krueger mask. Oh, and look right beside it. We have loving grandma. Hello, grandma. What in the world is this? It's a toilet mask. What the heck? Look, what is it called? It's just called toilet mask, but look, your face goes in the toilet. <laughs> what is this one laying down here? A creepy grin, scary clown. That is a pretty cool one right there. Put that on and put a hoodie up. Old clown mask. Look at his smile. That's hilarious. That kind of reminds me of the Joker. Zombie gas mask. Jingle jangle. That's what it's called. Dark side jingle jangle mask. It's like a clown jester devil something i don't know i don't get into the devil stuff but that looks pretty freaky oh here's the creepy grin scary clown steampunk mask with goggles that's pretty cool looking i love how it looks like leather that is pretty awesome this one is called last laugh the clown i can't get it off of there it's one of those where the um the jaw moves when you open your mouth whoa look at the lips the, li <laughs> the lips get wider Holy crap, and here's a werewolf in a motion mask. He does the same thing. You move your mouth and his mouth moves. Holy crap, look at this scary guy. Dark Harvest is what it's called. And he's another in a motion, so his mouth moves with yours. I can hardly do it with my hands. There's probably like a lock in there right now or something. But when you have that on your jaw, his mouth opens as you open yours. That is cool. 
Lil Stevie, what the heck is this? Okay, his jaw moves with yours too, but it's not the same kind of uh, like hard plastic as the other ones. What is this? Squiddles? What the heck? Look, look at his face. <laughs> oh my god. It's like Squidward gone bad. Okay, we got a skull tan mask. What is this? Miles of smiles. Holy crap. Look at this one, guys. Ginormous mouth with a huge smile and teeth. That's pretty hilarious. Serial killer mask. This is supposed to be kind of like leather face. Okay, look at this one. Fallen angel mask and wings. Look at that. That's pretty creepy. Oh, look. We got the voice changer right here. And right beside it is the ghost face mask. Holy crap, guys. January is the new Scream movie. Scream Part 5. He doesn't have the markings on the bottom. You know it's a legit Scream mask when they have the old markings on the bottom that says like Fun World or something? Yeah, it says it up here, but on, on the actual real, real masks, like the legit, legit ones, it says, I think, Easter Unlimited on there. Here we got Freddy. Oh, that's just the sweater, I think. Hold on, let's take a look. Yeah, this is just the Freddy sweater, but that's cool. I have looked in uh, thrift stores for a Freddy sweater, and I never found one. So, yeah, if you're looking one, they have them right here. If you're looking for one, I can't even talk. Okay, Friday the 13th, Jason. And this, again, this is just the hockey shirt, the mask. Oh, there's a mask with it, but dang. That's just like a foam one that looks like it would... Well, you need a new mask. Okay, this is all just makeup and stuff over here. They have some fake scars right here. Little ones here. Oh, that's like a bite. That's like a vampire bite. Okay, and then what is this right here? This is like a ripped flesh is what they call that. Those are pretty cool. I've never tried to put any of those on. But what in the world <laughs> is that? Botoxic lips. What the heck? You put those on your lips to make your lips even bigger. I actually know people that would wear those on a regular basis. I've always thought these were really cool too, these Dracula fangs. Look at those. Those look so real. <sighs> Oh, here's one of those zipper kits where you make it look like your face is kind of coming unzipped. I've always thought that was a pretty cool effect right there. Look at this. I think we saw this last year. It's like the Post Malone wig. What in the world? They call it SoundCloud Wrapper. <laughs> and of course, they have the world's biggest afro. Machetes, cyberpunk gun, military rifle. Okay. Oh, and then they got these couple of things here. These are um, pinatas, Day of the Dead. And then they have, oh look, Nightmare Before Christmas, Pumpkey, and a ghosty. I think we saw the pumpkies and ghosties in the other store we were at. Oh, and the spider, look, his legs are down too. That is cool. Oh wait, there's another aisle here. It looks like we almost missed. Holy crap, look at this. The 40 year old virgin waxed chest hair shirt. <laughs> oh, look at this. And they have the dance canes. This reminds me of uh, Dumb and Dumber. That scene where they go to the dinner and they accidentally kill the snow owl. What the heck? A mini cowgirl top hat. I think this is like for a dog. <laughs> I think you put that on your dog. Oh, here's another uh, steampunk hat. It's a top hat. That is actually pretty cool looking. I'd love to make one of those sometime just to see how it would turn out. That's pretty cool. Look at this. This reminds me of Panic at the Disco. What is that? A shoulder wing? It's like big black wings. Look at this one. Psycho Butcher. Oh my gosh. His name tag says Hannibal. What the heck? Okay, what is this? Modern Hero? This has got to be like a Tiger King jacket. Yeah, I guarantee that's what that is. Tiger King jacket. I think I said this before, but I have a friend who actually has a ton of clothes from the Tiger King that he actually wore. Oh my gosh, I thought we were done, but there's still a whole bunch of stuff over here. Now, this is all just like these party masks, but they're pretty cool. Anyway, look at this, a gold couple masks. I like that one. That's cool. Here's a pirate mask. Oh my gosh. Arr, matey. Silver mask. Uh, black and gold. Crystal mask. I love this one. Venetian rabbit mask. How cool is that? Tons of stuff in these carts that they're just getting ready to put up. Shoulder armor. That's pretty cool. It's like fake leather. Like from the movie 300. 
hooded green velveteen cape, a king robe, yes, somebody needs to be a king this year. <laughs> okay, yeah, another cart full of stuff that they're getting ready to put out, but there is, I can't believe how much space that they are dedicating to Halloween in this store, guys. This is gonna be off the chain when they get it all set up. It's like half the store from here all the way back around and like these three aisles that we just looked at over here. There is gonna be tons of stuff here when they're all set up. I told you to stay away!